like exploring solid rock. Oh, don't be so dreary. No one's ever been here before. We are sure to find something terribly exciting. Like that! <laughs> says, keep out. Well, they couldn't mean us, Paradise. Where could it lead, I wonder? Wait, what if there's something dangerous behind that door? Think, North Star, before you do anything rash. Very well, very well. Oh, drat. Let's have a go at it, shall we? North Star, please. This could be the golden door. A long, long time ago, the most fearsome creature ever known terrorized Ponyland. So, a sorcerer forged the golden door. A gateway to the land of legends. A mysterious far-off realm. And it was through that golden door that the beast was pushed into the land of legends. As long as no one passes through the door, the beast will remain there. So rein in that curiosity of yours, Northstar, and stay away from that door. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've had enough exploring for one day. A frightfully silly story. I fancy she simply made it up. Northstar! How could anything dangerous be behind such a lovely door? In any event, Paradise didn't say not to open it. She merely said not to pass through it. North Star, no! Oh, how dreary. Well, that certainly was a disappointment. Stand and deliver! Oh, no! Ho, steeds! What manner of pony are these? Hi, who'd be your master? Does he have any money? We, we have no master or money. No money? <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hood, Robin Hood. And these are my, uh, <laughs> merry men. Merry men? We are North Star and Lofty. Welcome to Ponyland. Ponyland, eh? Jolly good. Mayhap a holiday here would make my merry men a bit more merry. I say, everyone, come out and have a look. Ah, this is nice. There's quite a few of you. You're not all merry men. <laughs> no, no. We're legends and myths. There's Paul Bunyan and Babe, his ox. And Aladdin and his lamp. And Scheherazade. And there's Hercules. Uh, 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 it's coming! Uh, it's coming after us! Close it! Hurry! Shut the door! Uh -huh. I say, what was all that about? No, no, it's too horrible. That creature Paradise mentioned. Could that be what they're so afraid of that they all have come to Ponyland? Quite. Hmm. I guess we should let everyone know. Yeah. Oh. Oh, darling Paradise. Such a lovely bouquet. I would give it to my true love, but where is he? Will he never come into my life? Oh, Heartthrob, don't be discouraged. Your true love will show up. He's out there. I'm sure of it. There's a prince in your future somewhere. Your Sir Lancelot is waiting round the bend. Now you may be minus a royal highness, but your Romeo will show up in the end. But when will he arrive? How long must I wait? I know it will be soon, but let's leave the date to fate. There's a prince in your future heartthrob. 
of And he'll be exactly who you're dreaming of Handsome and disarming A regular prince charming When he comes, you'll know at once it's love Charming, of course. And I've been searching my whole life through for you, my sweet. You have? Promise me you will be together always. Darling, you needn't even ask. Huh? Dearest! Oh, how I've longed to find one so fair as you. But, but what about Heartthrob? Forget the past. Think only of the present. Us, together, now and always. <laughs> oh, my one true love. Oh, my sweet, how can you pass me by? True heart, it's you I love. Darling, don't go. I've got a funny feeling about this. I just love a tidy place, don't you? Oh, yes, Hercules, so do we. I haven't had so much fun since I cleaned the Aegean stables. Filthy dirt, filthy, filthy, filthy. Just like a willow in the breeze. <laughs> That's it, my little one. And that's how we do the dance of the Seven Veils. Gee whiz, it's a wonderful day for a picnic, Lickety Split. It truly is. Those clouds have me worried, Buttons, because it looks like it's going to rain and it might... What's that? It's a lamp that Aladdin fellow traded to me. It should clean right up. I think he tripped you, Buttons. There's no place to put a light bulb. What? I am the genie of the lamp, and I am obliged to grant you three wishes. May I take your order, please? You go first, lickety-split. I wish the weather was perfect. Perfect. Hmm. Could you be more specific? Temperature? Well, um... Uh... 82, 64, 179. Of 82? Relative humidity. Come on, come on, what'll it be? 5%, 10, 90? Well, but I haven't thought of it. And I'll also need to know the prevailing wind speed and the percentage of the color orange in the sunset. Look, all I want is a perfect day, so what's so difficult about that? And what about the sky? You have your cerulean blue, your robin's egg blue, your royal blue, or blueberry blue, cobalt blue. Well, North Star, I hope you're satisfied opening that door. We're practically being crowded out of the estate by uninvited guests. Shame on you. Come, come, Lofty. Tisn't that bad. No. What about the legend? If anyone passes through that door... Everyone came through the door already. And we shut it behind us. There was no monster. Monster? <laughs> oh, we don't have to worry. 